on the Sunscreen uh, Film Festival? No, Sunscreen Film Society. Yes. Okay, and we are with the president that he covers Clearwater, St. Petersburg, or Pinellas County, oh, and also his born Pinellas County, right? So, what's your name? Ziad Ahmed. And you are from? Morocco. And I have been in Morocco 2008. It's a beautiful country. We went nice. to Tanger. We went everywhere. That's we beautiful. get to buy stuff. Great nice. deals, guys. Go there. So how did you make it to become the president of this organization? Well, it, it's, it took a long time because I worked with the Florida Motion Picture and Television Association since 92. That's a long time. So we work for the state, promoting the film industry, pro, uh, teaching the, the students how, when they finish their schools, how, how to, to get involved in the filmmaking. You know, it's uh, when you when you're done with your study, the practice is very very important. You know, so that's what we do. Uh, we we make sure that all whoever is finishing school, we guide him where directly to where he needs to start you know interacting with the actors interacting with the crew uh, so all these things comes up uh, as a, as a as a cycle you know like little by little then he can he understand the real world because when you are in uh, in school it's books and writing and but when you are in the real world that's different that's completely different um, I I took my classes in uh, filmmaking since 85 in Oklahoma City wow. and, you know then I moved to Florida and I got involved with the Florida Motion Pictures of Israel Association then slowly but slowly they actually elected me as a president last year and this year <laughs> so uh, I'm, I'm really happy about it and uh, I, I do my best to keep everybody happy, everybody directed properly. Uh, we have a lot of workshops coming up next year. Uh, and i seen that there is a growth, actually, just from the last year to this year. Everybody moved from HD to a 4K production, and they got to any heavy production. So it's, it's a good, good, good outcome, you know. You know what? I have so many people that I know that wants to find out what to do to get in a movie. How do I get to be part of a movie production? It's, it's a really, really easy. Is to pay attention to all the meetings that they are going on throughout the whole month, because we have almost like three chapters that do a reunion of filmmakers, like next uh, February the 20th we have a huge huge party uh, in here in this property and it's international filmmakers appreciation award wow. so whoever made it in the movie industry he needs to thank the one who made it That's us. Right. you know who pushed him or actually who supported him to make it in the film industry so it's it's a win-win situation. So we hopefully we gonna uh, we're gonna promote this industry right here in Florida because we need the state involvement because without the state involvement there is nothing, you know. So uh, we get a lot of students from university. They finish school. They can't do nothing, and there is no filmmaking and nothing. So, uh, uh, but to be in touch with the film society. You need to get involved. You need to get. You need to sign up. It, it costs you seventy dollars a year, but still, you be in a meeting every month. You will know who's making a film, who's not making this, and you get involved. With, and people will ask you to come and act or to be a crew member. So, it's a it's a good thing to do. Pay attention to do to the film industry in the area where you live. That's that's the answer. <laughs> I'm very excited because actually what happened, and you must be aware of it, is the Hispanic community is growing very fast. Yes. We have many people from Venezuela, they are very strong on beauty and everything related to the, you know. Uh, yes. Just to add, I made a film in 2008, they call it 
by title a real premonition. A real premonition has 38 nationalities. I have Venezuela, I have Brazil, I have Germany, I have Morocco, I have even Middle East in it. So I took 36 nationality, I put them all together, and we made an action film. That's so beautiful, I wanna watch that film. Real Premonition, it's being distributed right now worldwide, and it's you can see it on YouTube. Uh, it's, it's a really cool film, but when you see everyone acting, it looks like everybody is in the same level, you know. Everybody learn from the other one and it moves on. So it, it's a really good. It's really what good. happened with the Hispanic community that may have challenges speaking English? Yes. Is there a window of opportunity for those people that have the talent but doesn't speak English, they speak Spanish? How we do? Absolutely, absolutely. We we have this, this the, the, uh, the Sunscreen Film Society, it's open for everybody, uh -huh. everybody. You know, actually, any Hispanic, if he has the ambition of filmmaking, please join us. You will never feel sorry. The reason why, because you get to meet, like we have right now, a group of people, everyone is from a different nationality. Then you learn that you, uh, I'm sure you're going to land on someone who says, yeah, I want you in my film. So don't be despaired. You have to get involved. Well, give me phone numbers, websites, Twitters, Facebook account. How is it that we do to contact you? Sunscreenfilmsociety.com. That's it. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> and you will, we have two meetings a month. You know, come on down, join us, and you learn. Then you can make your own plan, and you'll have other people supporting you making your dream come true. Thank you so much. Pleasure, pleasure. <laughs> Thank you. That was nice. nice Excellent. Nice.